Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very disturbing video to share with all of you. I'm pissed, Snooky Louise is pissed, and we're going to tell you guys the reason why. So I'm going to give you a little scenario here and um, I posted this already on Facebook so if you guys are watching that you've already um, seen the post then you know my scenario already. But here's a scenario for all of you guys who do not know what's going on. Say you go to Dairy Queen, okay? You got your money ready, and you have been dying for a medium-sized Oreo Blizzard, okay? You are just like into the Oreos, the luscious chocolate, the creamy center, how it's swirled all up in that ice cream, and you just want it. You're like drooling for it. So you get up and you order it, and they say, okay, it's three fifty dollars or however much it is, and you got your money ready, and you go to the window, and you pay the lady your three fifty, dollars and, you know, you are all excited to get it. It's coming. You can tell that they're getting it ready. They're putting it in there. They're crushing up that Oreo cookie, and you are just dying for it. And then somebody comes to the window and gives you a banana split and says, oh, we're sorry, we're out of Oreos, but here, take this banana split and eat it instead. You know what I would do? I would take that banana and I would shove it down the person's throat and say, you eat it. Give me my money back. But no, they already took your money. Ridiculous. So that's just one of the scenarios that happened that I found out today with a wax vendor. Um, somebody ordered from um, a wax vendor and they actually didn't have the oils and instead of emailing the person like a normal person would do, they actually sent wax in different scents and thought that it would be okay and um, replaced it with the things that the other people ordered. Completely wrong. Like, honestly, you honestly think that that's okay? That would be just like, ordering a sweater from Macy's in purple and getting a pair of pants in like green and saying, oh, we're sorry, we're out of purple sweaters, but here's a pair of green pants that you can wear. I'm sure you'll love them. Seriously? So here's my experience. I ordered from this vendor, um, I, I don't even know the dates. I don't even have it in front of me. It's sometime in July. Um, I was told that her tat time for custom orders was six weeks, so I'm willing to wait. And I figure, you know what, I have PayPal behind me for the 45 days, and six weeks I believe is 42 days or whatever the hell it is. I don't know, figure it out. So I'm like, okay, I've got PayPal behind me, whatever, but then I find out that she has a guarantee. And her guarantee, and I'm going to read it to you guys right now, so if I turn this way and read, and I'm not facing you guys, that's why. Well, I suppose I can move my laptop over. So, her guarantee states, we have a guarantee. Once we reopen, if your custom order does not ship within six weeks from the date your order was placed due to any happenings on our part, you will get a 50% off refund on your order and it will still be shipped to you in full. And if you're ready to ship, must be completely ready to ship, cannot contain any custom orders, which I understand, order does not ship within 10 days from the date your order was placed due to any happenings on our part, you will get a 50% refund on your order and it will still be shipped to you in full. Okay. So that guarantee was set in place. Somebody placed an order, um, got a click and ship, but did not get her box, um, still hasn't gotten her box and it's past the six weeks. So the vendor decides to post, oh, woe is me, my kids have been sick, my helper got ran over by a truck, um, I don't know what I'm going to do, I have laundry, my plant is sick, whatever, whatever, ha whatever shit happens, happens. Okay, so then all of a sudden, she changes the guarantee. So everybody who ordered now, who has placed orders, is supposed to be under this new guarantee which includes if my plant is sick, if my kids are sick, if my husband, you know, penis is an erect, if um, what else could possibly happen, if my health bear gets run over by a truck, if my dog, you know, ha anal sacs are completely filled and I have to drain them, then, you know, you have to excuse that. Seriously, that does not fly with me at all. So, I asked her a question because I still have my outstanding order and I said, you know, just to clarify things, I said I was just 
wondering, um, you know, you placed a new guarantee on your site. The people that ordered previous to that, um, are they still grandfathered underneath the old guarantee or are they underneath this new guarantee that you placed stating that, you know, sick days, whatever, uh, weekends, holidays, whatever. It's not six weeks anymore. It's basically, you know, you need to keep track of her Facebook page and you need to tell, um, you need to write stuff down on your calendar every day. Oh, you know, her kid threw up that day. Well, let me write that down. You know, little one threw up. Sorry, can't, uh, you know, we can't count that day as your six weeks. Or, oh, dog's anal sacs are filled, had to drain them. Oh, let me write that down. We can't do that now. So it's just absolutely ridiculous. Um, she deleted my post. I was, I was like really sincere, smiley faces, everything, whatever. Just wanted to know. She deleted my post, said that I was starting drama um, on her site. I was only asking about my order, really. So I told her that I just wanted a refund. Um, got the refund after I asked twice. Um, not a big deal. She said she was going to church and you know what? God bless you if you're going to church. I hope you play, pray to the baby Jesus, your baby Jesus, and I hope your baby Jesus makes you see the light because guess what your light is? Your light is right now about 150 people who used to order from you are not going to be ordering from you anymore because they know all of these scenarios. It is absolutely ridiculous. Um, the moral of the story is this is the bottom line for me. I'm, I, well, f actually it's not for me. It's for all of you because right now I have my list of vendors that I'm going to be ordering from that um, I can trust 100% that I've ordered from before that no one has ever had any problems with. So I'm set. I'm fine. But for all you people out there who are going to continue to order from people who are trying to swindle you and take your money and give you excuses after excuses after excuses, this is what you do. Fuck the 45 days from PayPal. Fuck it. Don't go by 45 days. Go to 40, okay? That way there's five days of a leeway time in there just in case. Because you know now what vendors are doing? They are getting anxious about that 45 days because they know that that's in place for PayPal. So what they're doing is they're taking that 45 days and they're sending out a click and ship on that 42nd day. Oh, I have a click and ship. Oh, don't worry, it's in the mail. Well, a week goes by. Where's my package and why hasn't it been accepted? You know why it hasn't been accepted? Because the goddamn vendor made up a click and ship, put it on your box, and your box is sitting, sitting underneath the tissue of the anal glands that she used to distract from the dog. That's where your box is because they are making up click and ships and they are putting the box off to the side so they say, oh, it's an empty box, no big deal, they won't know. They'll think that their box is shipped, but really, it's sitting in the corner by the trash with nothing in it, but they'll think that it's shipped, so we're safe. Well, no more. So I want you guys to be aware that that is what's happening. Um, they're sending out their click and ships early. Obviously, I'm making up the part about the dog. It's, I, I mean, I have Snooky with me. You know, her anal sacs do need to be clean. But anyway, I'm not using that as an excuse for any part of my life whatsoever. Um, but anyway, just to let you guys know that this is really happening. Um, they are sending out click and ships like a week early, not sending out the packages. So then that way you won't make a PayPal claim. And it's if it's over your 45 days, then screw it. You can't do it. You won't get your money back and you will have to wait for their wax. No matter if it's a week late, two weeks late, three weeks late, four weeks late, a month late, whatever. So please, please, please be smart. Please, please know what you guys are getting into. Um, if a business has a guarantee in place, throw it out the window. Don't even read it. Go buy your own guarantee. And that guarantee for me is 40 days, um, sometimes less. So I got a refund from this vendor, thank God. Um, and all is well on my end. Other people um, are number one, not getting their refund. Number two, um, not getting a response at all from this person after um, they have emailed this person, after they have tried to contact this person through message on Facebook, trying to hide it from the personal uh, business group page. But um, 
those, you know, pages or those messages are being ignored. So my advice to you is put it on the group page. If they want to air their dirty laundry, then go right ahead and air their dirty laundry because if that's going to get you your order, all the more power to you. So that's all I have to say. Um, I'm going to be going to Bath and Body Works and getting some mint hand cream with the 30 some dollars that I got refunded me and everything is a-okay in my book. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. I'm not going to do any ratings on this one because I'm sure I'm going to get tons of thumb downs just because they're going to have all their little groupies come and like watch this, whatever. I don't care. Hi groupies. I hope you guys are safe. I hope you guys get your orders and um, I'm so happy that you really love her wax. I love her wax too. I've gotten some in D stashes and round robins, but unfortunately I will never be ordering from this uh, person. If you guys want to know, message me on Facebook who I'm talking about. I'm sure everybody knows. So thank you guys so much and have a great day. Bye guys. Oh my snooky.